Mexico's president claims the country's violent criminal gangs and drug cartels are essentially respectful people who respect the citizenry. He added they mostly just kill each other. The claims are clearly at odds with the reality of millions of Mexicans who live in areas dominated by drug cartels. The cartels routinely demand protection payments from locals and kill or kidnap them if they refuse to pay. A reporter asked President Andres Lopez Obrador whether drug cartels behaved well when he visited the hometown of El Chapo, something he's done dozens of times. He said, always, sometimes we come upon people who are strange but respectful. Lopez Obrador has long refused to order direct confrontation with cartels. He claims cartel members were forced into a life of crime because of a lack of opportunities. His hugs, not bullets strategy offers training for youth so they won't become criminals. However, saying the cartels don't attack common people takes the issue to another level. Experts and rights activists say thousands of Mexicans have been forced from their homes by cartel violence and extortion. And thousands of business owners, taxi and bus drivers have been killed for refusing extortion demands. Mm. Thursday's statements by the president come more than a month after he said he won't fight Mexican drug cartels on U.S. orders. The president called it a Mexico first policy. He said we are not going to act as a policeman for any foreign government. Mexico first, our home comes first.